Welcome guys to Pinoy Crossover. It's your boy today, your host, Marky Mark with Scarf. Here we are, we're in our very own Pretty PJ. PJ. Pretty. He's looking good. And we got a very special guest right here, Nelly. Do you want to go take a ride? How you feeling rally? today? I'm good. 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 You guys all ready? So we're going to start off quick. And we're going to play our very own huh? Pinoy Showdown. And this is going to be fun. I'm going to ask these guys some questions with two answers, and they have to choose the answer, and they have to defend why the answer is better than the other. Okay. Are you guys mm -hmm. ready? Yeah. All right. Let's get it. You got a questionnaire. You got first question. Who is the better, more improved player this year? DeMar DeRozan or Giannis? When I say three, two, one, and I want you guys to say it at the same time. Are you guys ready? Okay, you got it. Three, two, one. Giannis. DeMar. Ooh, why Giannis? Giannis, the last year, uh, MIP to MVP. Look at him, tell him straight up. MIP to MVP is the biggest improvement you can make in the terms of the public. Everyone was saying he's playing MVP-like. He's obviously, okay, you're going to say hey, they haven't been winning, but look, his stats, man, just, his, just, just him being, you know, on the same level or being in the same category as LeBron with everything and just his domination, his athleticism, his length. He's he's trying to pull up his shots, but um, you can't deny the fact that he has big potential. DeMar, I don't know. DeMar's not, DeMar's had a 152 point game. Until DeMar has another 50 point game, I don't think he's gonna be as improved and as an MVP. And we're talking about MVP as in the whole NBA. I don't think DeMar will be considered an MVP for years to come. That's a big, hey, that's a big, that's a big statement. But hey, so Giannis is most improved because he went from MIP to now everyone thinking that he could be the MVP. Ooh, yeah. Why DeMar? DeMar, work ethics. You know, he's brought something to his game every year and now he's bringing a three-point shot. He has a three-point shot. He's not just a mid-range assassin anymore. And he's playing better defense. On top of that, he's facilitating. He's actually assist he's bringing he's moving the ball he's not doing those traditional iso ball anymore and it's it's he's a lot harder to defend and he's actually making his team better and there's just more to come you know giannis he doesn't have a three-point shot yet but you know he'll probably get it in the future and on top of that he's more athletic right like giannis but demar is not athletic so yeah. he, he uses his heart work ethics wise demar all the way but uh yeah, i'd give it to demar right now who plays better right defense Who's made the biggest stride from last year to this year? Why do you think Giannis made the biggest stride from this year to from last year? Are you asking me a question? Yeah. <laughs> what, what Why do you think Giannis has made the biggest stride? He's looking at you. <laughs> I'm done. What, what, what's, cause what stat? Or like, what are you talking about? Stat, anything that like tangi intangible, tangible. I'm just talking about intangible. I'm just talking about his relentless, his aggressive, his assertiveness. I've, and you talk about work ethic, but I think Giannis, like his handle's a little bit tighter. And I feel like, yes, his team's not winning, but like, he's just becoming more of a, that all-star category type player. And DeMar, I don't think is like, well, I don't think, like I said, I don't think we can see him to be in the MVP race for a while. What about you? What about the stride that DeMar made compared from last year to this year? The biggest thing is the three-point shot. He's, he's not afraid to take them, and he's making them. So, you know, and he's, and he's passing the ball. He assists the rate. Every, all, everything went up in terms of his stats as well. His defense actually got better. Mm. He's reading the defenders better. You know, he knows when to help D and everything. So, uh, you got Next question, to finish it off. <laughs> who's, been the more, who's been the more valuable player in the Warriors right now? Mm. Steph Curry? Or Kevin Durant. Easy. Three, Easy. two, one. Steph Curry. KD. Why Curry? Curry. Oh, ever since he came back, you know, he's just dropping threes like it's it's like a three free throw for him, and he's doing assists and everything. So, I, I just feel like he's he's doing the same uh, what he's always been good at. You know, is an MP, MVP level. Craft yeah. dinner. KD. Cheese. Game one. time. Money. When Steph Curry went out, he showed that he could lift Golden State. And even last year, Curry didn't play that well, but KD rose to the occasion and he played clutch minutes, he hit clutch shots. Without KD, we're talking about MV we're talking about most viable. He was most viable last year and also this year too because of the matchups. Obviously Steph Curry, um, Steph Curry with threes, but like KD poses a good matchup 
for any type of superstar and he'll guard them. He's playing better defense. You talked about DeMar the last question. We have to give a shout out to KD. He's averaging some blocks. He's getting a lot of blocks. I've never seen KD block that many times. So we're, we're, we're talking about KD who's improving defensively and now I feel like he's, so, he's, he's more valuable in terms of both sides of the court. That's all we have for Pernod Kosovo Showdown. Before we end it, I want to give him points. Um, for the most improved player, I'm going to give it to Giannis. He's right. <laughs> Going from a most improved to an MVP candidate. Yeah. That's a big jump, right? It's the biggest but, jump. <laughs> got, still got love for my DeMar, man. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. I still got love for him, but I think Giannis has made the bigger jump from the most improved player last year to just an MVP caliber Absolutely. player. In terms of the most important valuable player, I'm going to give it to Curry actually because of the fact that the That's way biased. He's look at, is that as a Curry's t-shirt? I'm not saying that. I'm saying <laughs> just the way the Warriors play. Mm -hmm. It revolves around the title play that Curry has, whereas Durant has been the better player and the best player, I think, in the Warriors. Mm -hmm. Just the way they play, it, it, it all revolves around the way Curry plays. Yeah. And that's all we have for Bernard Carlson Showdown. I hope you guys enjoy that.